Happy Friday, Mustangs. My name is Sean Bloor. Good uh, to see you, Mustangs. I'm McKay Butler. And this is your bulletin for Friday, January 17th, 2014. Let's get started. Winter Independent PE time cards are due to miss floors by 4 p.m. on Thursday, January 23rd. In the counseling office with a final signature from your coach at the bottom of the card. There will be absolutely no exceptions after the deadline, so be sure to get it in before or by the deadline. Third annual Benefit Dance Show, featuring dances from SRV USD high schools. Come to the show on Saturday, February 8th at 7 p.m. at San Ramon High School Performing Center of Arts. See Printed Bolton for more details. Attention all spring sport athletes. If you are planning on participating in a spring sport, the deadline to turn in completed sports packets is this Friday, January 24th. The sports packets may be picked up in the bookkeeper's office or downloaded from the Monta Vista website. See printed bulletin for more details. High School Acoustic Night performances can apply now. Are you a musician or in a band? Last chance to apply to perform at High School Acoustic Night. The San Ramon Parks and Community Services Department is hosting Acoustic Night for high school students on Friday, January 31st. See the printed bulletin for more details. Want to be this year's Mr. Mustang? Hey, Monta Vista men. Do you want to be this year's Mr. Mustang? If so, please stop by room 209 to pick up a packet. They are now available. The packets are due back to leadership on Wednesday, January 29th. Hey Mustangs, do you want two free tickets to Warriors game? Find this ball at lunch and you can win two free tickets. You can be a winner. Last week's hashtag was hashtag MV resolutions. Here are your top tweets. This week's hashtag is hashtag MV puns. Okay, so tweet your cheesiest puns. Do you have a friend whose birthday's coming up? <laughs> Do you want to surprise your friend on their birthday? Here's how. Pick up a slip outside of the leadership room or in the office and leadership will deliver a specialized card and balloon to your friend on their birthday. of an intimate experience with John Kaiser and David Van Sicklen. I'm your host, David Van Sicklen. And I'm John Kaiser. And today we have a special guest. He's a uh, freshman here, for those of you who might possibly know him. His name is Grant Neely, and word on the street is he's been studying very, very hard for his upcoming finals. Can we bring Grant in here, please? So Grant, you're a freshman here, correct? Yes. So this is your first final coming up? Mm -hmm. Awesome. Um, can you tell us a little bit about how you are studying for this final? I've been studying hard. I've been doing the flashcard method. Mm -hmm. If you have ever heard of it. Yes, no. <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah, that's pretty much it. Yeah, have you been uh, going to any libraries, reading some books? Yeah, Devo Library. Mm -hmm. Yeah, no, That's a great place. And yeah. this wonderful oh, yeah. student center, of mm -hmm. course. Yeah, don't forget that. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's in here too. Mm -hmm. um, so, any of your classes, you know, upcoming finals, do they, do they even really have your uh, your goose cooked, you know, got you on edge a little bit? Yeah, geometry. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. 
Yeah. Any uh, shapes in particular that don't suit your fancy? Triangle. Yeah, triangle. Yeah. yeah. So, uh, moving on a little bit, the most important part of any day, of course, mm -hmm. as we all know, is breakfast. So, uh, in preparing for this final, what's uh, what's your game time meal? What are you doing? Some sourdough, mm -hmm. over easy eggs, nice yeah. orange juice. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. You ever heard of Wheaties? No. It's the breakfast of champions. Is it? Mm -hmm. yeah. 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 I've been on the box before. Have you? Congratulations. Thank you. Mm -hmm. So, you uh, you nervous for finals? A little bit. Oh boy. Oh gosh. What? You, you messed up. You goofed. Huh? Yeah, you messed up big time. What is it? You uh, never heard of the finals goblin? No. The finals goblin. Oh gosh, tell him the legend. Legend has it that the uh, finals goblin during the uh, week of finals comes for nervous teens like yourself, finds you in your classroom and gobbles you up. Mm-hmm. That's it for this edition of An Intimate Experience with David Van Sicklin and John Kaiser. Run for the hills. We start off at Monta Vista where men's soccer took on De La Salle. Right off the bat, Reed Gratch hits Jeff Greenberg on the long shot. Jeff sets his sights and who put that crossbar there? Barely misses to get both teams fired up early. Later, Matthew Freda sends it to Charles Zalumas who outmaneuvers the goalie to score the go-ahead shot for the first and final goal of the game. Zalumas is one happy camper. Monta Vista's goalie Nick Pellegrini lays out to keep the Mustangs ahead. Zalumas tries for his second goal of the game but finds the crossbar for a close miss. At the other end of the field, Dela tries to get fancy and Mitchell Peterson says, Look Ma, no hands. He plays goalkeeper for the moment and digs the ball out of harm's way to hold the Mustang lead. Cole Koonsman follows suit by punting the ball away after a close call to hold the game for a Mustang victory. Final score 1-0. Now we go to basketball. The Mustangs had a huge matchup when Freedom High came to take on the Stangs, but never fear. Armed with an excited six-man and a handful of star players, the Mustang would give Freedom a run for their money. To start it off, Stefan Matu drains the three to put the Mustangs up 18-12. Then it's more Matu who does the good old dribble and shoot maneuver to extend the Mustang lead. Grant Jackson has a chance to show his stuff. He tears apart the defense and makes the layup. But wait, there's more. Jackson comes out of nowhere to show the Stangs defense doesn't mess around. He capitalizes and gets points for the Stangs. Rishi Satur goes hard in the paint with complete disregard for the Freedom defense and maneuvers his way to a basket for the Stangs. With the game winding down, Satur goes to Brendan Pedley who leaves the Freedom high defense scratching their heads as he makes the three-pointer. Monta Vista achieves yet another victory at home. Now, back to your rally chairs. Well, Mustangs, that's it for the Bulletin today. I'm going to go hide this ball, so I'll uh, see you in a few.